When it comes to research, it's one thing that you understand it, the person collecting the information, but sometimes it's not always easy that somebody else can understand the work that you've done. Now, I've taken a video and taken some still images from the video to try to further explain what's going on in this video. And I hope the Jerry Morris channel doesn't like sue me or nothing, but we're on the, I, I agree with what he found, but just to maybe clear it up a little bit, I'm just giving a little bit of my explanation onto what I seen in his footage. It goes back into what I said about range or pinpoint. My range theory is just a theory. I do not know exact locations of range or size of range. I still believe that the equinox and the moon rising and setting went just like it reads. So without further ado, let's review what I got. When you watch the video, these are the two points on the hill that you need to pay attention to. The moon on the right, sun on the left. These lines draw toward where the sun and the moon will contact the horizon and set. The footage of the moon in this picture is zoomed in more than the footage of the sun, so that might be why it's a little confusing to some. I circled the moon because it gets really hard to see as it gets down toward the horizon. These lines are exaggerated just a little bit, but let's just say for a second that that equinox distance or range is the size of the sun and the moon. Since they're both the same, you could use that. Just because it doesn't set in the exact pinpoint spot does not mean it's still not good to go. Just like anything in life, ultimately it comes down to you. What do you believe? What can you convince yourself of? What can you prove to yourself that is or is not? So... People are doing a lot of work to try to share what they have found to be true or not true, depends on what you believe. And it's still up to you to do the work and find out what you believe and what you understand. I can't take credit for the stills in this video, Jerry Morris channel, thanks to you. And I hope you're not like totally pissed off that I used your couple clips, couple of stills. I hope it cleared things up a little bit. There were some that seemed a little unsure what was going on. I just threw my two cents to it. Hope it helps. Anyway, have a good day. Thanks for watching.